drunk bills. Um, Winner semis. Alright, so we got Gronk versus Bills. Gronk, uh. Well, I'm actually. They strike to Smashville. Gronk's really been leaving a uh, Green Hill Zone open a whole lot this time. It's a bit of an interesting choice for a Squirtle player. Uh, but, I mean, if he's confident there, then all the better. We're seeing a lot of, uh. We've been seeing a lot of that neutral beat today. Just a quick get away from you. I think during, uh. During a versus Barth match, that's really going to help him out. That is, unless he blocks it. <laughs> that was a beautiful up B to get out of the pressure. How you doing, Xander? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. These guys must have just started, right? Yeah, just now. Haven't even taken a stock yet. We had some real close calls earlier, but uh, Grunk got out of it pretty nicely with the up B. Oh, and an oh, early mom spaghetti. Um. Grunk off to a bit of a rough start, but looks like he's about to even it up. Yeah, there uh, we go. There it is. So these these two have a tiny, like very very tiny history. They've only played one set before. Uh, these are the two least played versus each other uh, out of our like big five. right under uh, the top tier locally speaking uh, so any set between these two is worthwhile uh, it was really close last time I'm pretty sure it was game five last stock uh, already looking really even and I wouldn't be surprised to keep or to see it stay at this pace most of the time unless one of them just catches on the other and then we're seeing Bills win. get pretty hungry for the kill here, going for a uh, lot of dares. That is not a surprise when it comes to Bills. Uh, he's going to try to get, like, he's, he's going to try to force that F smash or uh, that down air on Squirtle's up B a lot. Mm -hmm. um, and right there, kind of surprised to see him go for it. Did, did you say Bills is an impatient player overall? Uh, he needs to be smarter about that kind of stuff get destroyed bills but on the other hand he's very patient sometimes <laughs> when it comes to certain punish game things like uh, when he does have control then he's patient and he doesn't just give up control uh, unless it's trying to force ending a stock with an F smash like that or it's like I'm just gonna F smash in neutral well I mean there's only there's only so much you can do at this point at well, because okay, I think that's a huge misconception, actually. Like, huge, awful way of thinking related to Marth. Because Marth has the exact same neutral game. Like, it doesn't lead into the same combos or anything. But he still has an incredibly effective neutral game at all percents. Doesn't matter what percent you're at if you're in the neutral game. Because he should still be able to wall out people. And when he walls out people and then finally gets one hit, then he, can, he retains control for that whole time. So all you have to do is keep playing the Marth neutral game. You don't get big punishes uh, anymore, but like you're not going to lose because of it. You just need to not change up your style and force things like F-Smash. And that's when Marths start losing, when they mess that up. Uh, but Bills takes the lead with uh, another uh, poor decision by Kunk, I guess. <laughs> Unfortunate circumstance. I'm Let's be honest here. Grunk's, Grunk's had a pretty good show. Uh, that being said, I think uh, I think he's nervous. I right. think I'm. You gotta I made talk more into the microphone. Right. Yeah, put the microphone like right next to your mouth. Got it, boss man. Yeah, that's way better. All right. Uh, so once again, we're back to uh, back to last stock scenario. Friday once weekend. again, this is game one. <laughs> That's a secret. Ain't nobody needs to know that. Unless you're talking about like multiple sets between other people. 
Uh, I don't know if you've been commentating last time. <laughs> no. Uh, okay. I only came over here for a start of this. Okay. Now, uh, we're seeing... Ooh, good little string by Grunk. Oh, and bad you. trade by Bills. Uh, all, all Grunk needs to do is grab, grab the edge right there. Um, that, that's, uh, that was a common theme last time these two played. Grunk missed mm. so many edge guards. Uh, like he'd go for uh, that runoff fair or something like that, that you can get away with in Smash 4 because like people just grab the edge in that game. So like you can whiff that fair and then just grab the edge anyway and you're fine. Uh, in, very good in PM, you whiff it and then you get edge guarded. Um, and Bill is stuck off stage. Okay, Grunk not going off stage that time. Billy looking for the, the F smash when Grunk crossed him up. Uh, Ooh, kind of risky decision there by Grunk. Mm -hmm. Ooh. <laughs> Either player could have pushed it out. Oh, oh my god. what a beautiful <laughs> up B. That is the opposite of beautiful, <laughs> I think. <laughs> I'm, I'm starting to regret making this a money match. This is a money match? Uh, I put forth money. Oh, against whom? Uh, Grunk. Okay, so. Because I'm salty. You want Billy to win? I want Billy to win. But this you the love that. the first time I've ever said that. <laughs> Billy grimaces a tiny bit. But anyway, I was totally on Billy's side after that up B because I'm like, there's no way that I should be hitting right there and uh, it shouldn't kill. <laughs> Pure, unadulterated nonsense. And we're going back to FD. I think this is a, this is a very interesting choice by both players. Gunk, I got a pretty strong showing, uh, showing on uh, FD in our earlier Ooh. match. And, ooh, he's in a rough scenario here. Well, he made it back. Billy dropped the edge guard, uh, but we're gonna see those kinds of combos by Squirtle, and Martha's gonna get juggles. He's gonna get his neutral game, um, and Grunk's gonna whiff more of these, I think. I mean, after uh, after the showing of upbeat last session, do you really think that he wouldn't? Uh, would he whiff them? No. Would he go for them? It's not really worth it, though, if you know it's not gonna hit. Like. You shouldn't let that last game affect your overall strategy because that wasn't a neutral game win. That wasn't a, in a combo or something. That was just like, Billy didn't edge guard Squirtle correctly. Actually, we've, we've been kind of seeing that as a theme. Ooh, here. that's a different aerial of from Grunk. Billy not quite closer to knowing the edge how, to, uh, how to deal with Squirtle at the edge. Well, that's like a, a melee player versus a PM player kind of thing where Billy is the melee player and he doesn't know a lot of PM knowledge uh, whereas Grunk even though he doesn't like own PM uh, according to him uh, he plays a PM character that Bills is certainly not used to uh, like Billy hasn't lapped out all of the, the Marth combo game mm. on this character like right there he didn't he didn't go for the right option perfectly or something and I mean, Squirtle is so small that not everything's Ooh. gonna transfer from other characters. I mean, that's another. Key. Oh, that was a very good, uh, very good down tilt. A yeah, better time down tilt that time. Now uh, and uh, space. we're seeing the FT not really working out, uh, but, or rather, working out too well for uh, for Bills. Yeah, it's it's helping uh, him force his neutral game on Grunk. Like Grunk is not able to get around. Uh, anything on FD, uh, you just kind of have to deal with, alright, it's a one big platform. Like, when one player is in the air, they're just kind of stuck up there. Which actually can backfire, and mm. this is, that's why I don't choose FD against PM characters. Cause Shout outs to like, our friendlies. Uh, well, uh, it's just, I don't like the stage anyway. Yeah. Um, like, I don't want to play the neutral game. I want to go around platform and, and have fun. Because uh, I play platformer games. I don't play Smash. FD. Uh, all right, so where do you think we're going to head this time? Well, uh, we are seeing the largest stages banned. Uh, Grunk's team seems to like, uh, well, what I see from most from Grunk is like Smashville, Battlefield, uh, Pokemon. He uh, likes to have room to work with. Yeah, uh, so this is the biggest remaining stage. Uh, yeah. The microphone says a match. Nope. Um, <laughs> and no one will know. No one. Again, 
back to get my money. That's different. You could have made it 20 even <laughs> if you entered. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry. Oh well. <laughs> uh, so, uh, but this saying? is game three. Okay. Uh, so that there's an edge guard by Bills. Like he's that. got he's got the invincibility that time at a good time. Uh, was able to get the down air. Uh, when he can do that, it's totally effective. Just it's up to Grunk to mess up, uh, mix up the timing on the upbeat. Gotcha. Okay. So you think that uh, Bills has gotten a good. Uh, handle on how to actually uh, cover Squirtle's recovery now that he's shown it with that down air? I, uh, I would not say he has a good understanding of that okay. for uh, just a few edge guards. Like, he's missed some. He's He's got some. He doesn't okay. have that good of an understanding. Like, right there. Yes. Okay, um, I see. Like, sometimes he hits that down tilt. Sometimes he doesn't. Gotcha. Uh, so, Grunk is still going to get back sometimes related to that, but Grunk's edge guard game on Mars. I think it's going to be more important. Because um, he'll get some good strings against Marth every now and then, but then he'll just kind of let Marth <laughs> get control back. Okay. Um, like he'll just kind of let things return to neutral without getting Well, no. Like, he'll uh, he'll go off stage, miss an attack. Like, uh, kind of like that? Kind of like that, but worse. Uh, but that's that's a similar enough situation to this. Uh, like, if he, if he went off stage and whiffed, then Marth would be on stage, he's off stage. That's bad. Yeah. Okay. Uh, if he's listening to me, uh, then <laughs> he has heard me say this multiple times. So hopefully he has adjusted. If not because of me, just in general. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Through his own observational powers. Yeah. Mark not covering that much of the stage. Uh, trying to end the stock early with F Smash. Yeah, actually, at uh, 117 <laughs> early. <laughs> uh, Gun Girl's a tiny bit too early. So is this Grunk's counter pick? Yes. Yes, okay. Uh, Billy lost game one and counter picked <laughs> FD. Uh, and okay. he's he's done some good adaptations since then. Like he figured out something related to Grunk and how he moves around and gets punished okay. uh, on that FD game. And Grunk's been having some trouble getting any hits in since then. Yeah, um, it kind of seems like um, Billy's content just kind of um, either get away from an approaching Squirtle or um, cover the space right in front of him with forward air. Well, uh, one of the biggest neutral game tools that uh, I'd like to see Gunk use better uh, is like his bubble and water gun game, uh, uh. which he should be thinking about using right now, like when they're that far away. Yeah, so that's how he gets control. Billy's not really getting messed up by it too much afterward anymore, uh, but uh, like that outranges Mark's sword. That's a big deal. Yes. Um, like this is one of the the biggest things that T did versus me last week. Ah. Okay. Uh, where like that outranges and outspeeds a lot of Ike stuff. So it's really important to know. Yeah, I uh, think the uh, the outspeeds is an important uh, thing to take note of. Maybe uh, because Marth has generally faster moves with comparable range. <laughs> He Grunk. may not be quite as comfortable with just throwing it out without getting hit himself. Yeah, Grunk forced uh, finishing off that stock by going off stage. Yeah. Uh, but now he doesn't really know what to do uh, on this stock. And Billy messes up the down air. Uh, yeah, he's been whiffing a few forward smashes too. So if Grunk could get a strong punish, that would say a lot going into game four. Yeah, and also probably make for a general uh, change in tone of the game since he hasn't really. Ooh. Shown strong awkward up B yeah. uh, and up tilt, yeah. semi awkward up tilt. Was <laughs> that that weird uh, inward hitbox angle? Yeah, that was ideal in that case. It would not have killed if it did, because it's tall ceiling. Yeah. So tall ceiling again, but shorter sides. Uh, this is, I think what we saw Grunt counter pick the last set between these two. Okay. Um, Earlier up B this time, uh, still catching Marth, looking for down tilt. Uh, there, okay, so Billy got close uh, before Grunk could throw out the uh, the B reverse water gun. Uh, when Grunk usually does the, the B reverse for it, like right yes. here, he might dash back and then okay. uh, B reverse water gun. That's more of a neutral game thing with him. Uh, but when he's close, he's gonna be looking for those attacks because like he can't do a water gun right now, uh, and that's like a, a get back on the stage kind of move. Uh, it seems safe a lot of the time, but if 
someone catches on to it, uh, then it's going to get punished pretty hard. Would you happen to know uh, good uh, when, conversion? Uh, when Squirrel's in the shell, does he have super armor or like light armor? Pretty sure it's light armor. Okay. So does um, he have it for the duration of being in the shell? Yeah. Lots of little hits. Uh, Squirtle hopping up and down is pretty funny, yeah. I think. <laughs> uh, one of the more enjoyable moves in the game that doesn't even look like a move. It's just like it's Squirtle. It's just Squirtle going up and down. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's very effective, it turns out. <laughs> Nair getting grabbed. Uh, that's one way to get away from the armor. Uh, good opening Ooh. there, but no big conversion. would have been really cool. I like the idea, at least as far as... Um, Oh, smart Nair. Uh, don't agree with that Nair uh, at all. Could have just grabbed the edge, been invincible, punish Marth when he lands on stage. Yeah, it seems like generally grabbing the time. edge versus Marth is a great idea. I mean, yeah, you get invincibility. <laughs> yeah, and not only that, but uh, when Marth is forced Ooh. to land on stage, he is he takes a inactive. Lag. Yeah, yeah. basically like half a second. So. If you know that he's just going to be on stage. Yeah. Maybe after the set, I'll, uh, I'll talk with Gunk a little bit about that. Like, hey, by the way, you can just grab the edge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then this is the flow chart. Yeah. I, uh, I mentioned it before, but um, it seems like that's... Uh, okay, there's the, the water gun. Okay, yeah. Uh, didn't get anything from that opening, though. Uh, very even right now. And there's the bubble that is like a get off me. Yes. Like I want to land. Oh, forces another good uh, to, like, down tilt yeah. order. Uh, the smaller sides are definitely helping out and get away with that. And Billy's still messing up the, the down tilt. Yeah, uh, it looks most like of the time he doesn't get hit and doesn't hit, hit the down hit. tilt. <laughs> so it just means that it's drunk on the ledge. Yeah. Yeah. It seems That's like time he got him in slowly too early, I think. Yeah, probably. All right, Gunk grabs the edge, goes for the bear. Could have just waited on the edge. And it's uh. Oh, we had the squirrel's recovery is bubble. similar in that if he actually has to land on stage, he'll suffer. Okay, Bills gets the F smash and retreats to the edge. Uh, good spacing by Grunk on these back airs. Oh, uh, he's not gonna get punished for those. Uh, but he gets pressured as soon as he whiffs one too close to Mark. Uh, and he got, got con shield. Okay, there's the viewer versus water gun. Oh, that's not going to connect. Yeah, no. And the platform gets in the way uh, for the punish. Uh, back air might be enough to take it. Uh, no. oh, rolls, rolls slightly too early. Too early but it probably good timing been, on the upbeat. Yeah, it would have been to his advantage to just refresh invincibility so he could... Uh, oh, Billy wanted to end uh, it with down air. So cool, <laughs> but he did. He uh, reels back, laughs a tiny bit, but... Uh, but it's his counter pick probably meant to jump. <laughs> yeah, so... Uh, I would think... A smaller stage is going to come into play. Uh, in the middle is where we're going to go, turns out. Yes. Battlefield. Game 5. This is what we saw last time between these two people. Uh, I'm pretty sure in the same order as well. <laughs> wow. Um, Grunk lost on his first counter pick and then won on his second counter pick. And then Billy clutched it out barely game 5. Alright, let's see if... Uh, I mean, uh, it looks like Grunk's gotten some decent conversions so far to start off the game. Which is kind of... Oh, At least yeah, this is, okay, so uh, that little combo, that's one of the dangers of Battlefield, if Squirtle can get those right up airs. Because um, it'll uh, let him uh, hop off the top platform to get a good up B? Yeah, like it'll actually combo, rather than on those flatter stages where, uh, like, it's unlikely to combo. Okay. Uh, just because you can't up air and then land on a platform. Gotcha. Uh, I don't totally agree with where he's positioning himself, uh, edge guarding Marth still. Um, okay, this time grabs the edge, oh. messes up the wave. <laughs> but instead of letting Grunk die, he kills him himself. And Billy <laughs> grabs the edge. Oh. <laughs> okay, that was that's something that Grunk could learn more from. That edge guard. Yes. Uh, and Billy just gets way too close to the back air. Oh yeah. So even uh, again, uh, side beat a back air a oh, couple nice. times. Oh, this there. Oh, this up air. 75% convert, 74% convert. Yeah, I feel like Grunk could have converted into up B uh, with that. Um, Maybe just with... Uh, well, no, he uh, he barely missed time yeah. one of the last up airs, and then just needed up B after it. Uh, like, Billy SDI'd 
uh, as much as you could to the side. Uh, yeah. But like, I don't think it was enough. Okay. Squirtle mains would know. So you think uh, that uh, Squirtle was able to oh, drift Oh, really not ready further. for that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, he comes down with F-Smash. Uh, Grunk just avoids the neutral B. Yes. Oh, another good opening with Bubble. Uh, I feel like he was going to land with another one right there, actually. Yeah, I think... Uh, Billy just like snuffed it out before it came out. Yeah, it looks like... Uh, Kinda maybe bad. Billy's trying to challenge the uh, how true the combos really were that Grunk was yeah. getting before. And forward air is a great move to do just that, since it comes out so quickly. Oh, another bubble trip. Uh, crossed up there. I right, grabbed the edge. He went for the same back air, and high uh, high up B gets punished sometimes. Oh. Not all the time though. Otherwise, Billy would have taken that stock. <laughs> uh, good combo. Yeah, uh, nice very even down still. Down here to up air. Uh, don't go for the up B, please. <laughs> like if he no, missed, he like he's just gonna <laughs> he be punished on the spot, way down. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's smarter to go for. Uh. Billy still has to jump, so he gets the edge. Okay, good grab setup. Hey, that's the kind the of top. yeah, that's the kind of play that I want to see from Grunk. Gotcha. Like, don't go off stage and then let Billy take control again. Uh, he kept control, uh, recognized like Billy still has to jump, and he's gonna make it back. Um, sometimes you just gotta deal with that. Yeah. Uh, okay, but Billy's gotta take this stock before. Uh, too long. Or else oh, uh, does he have a jump? Oh, Whoa! I guess he did have a he, jump. I don't know. It looks like yeah. um, Grunk just messed mercy. up way down there. Didn't Grunk, have to go down there. He's trying to finish him off. Uh, yeah, really. So we're gonna see some careful there. play from Bills right now. Yes. And he's gonna look for F smash definitely. <laughs> uh, like if he had a chance uh, on the edge right here, he's yeah he's gonna like look that? for Ooh. it. Like that? Do you think uh, um, something like F throw F smash uh, works effectively on Squirtle? No. Rolls a little bit too early, but better to be safe than sorry in this case. Oh, there he goes. There's an F smash tipper. Uh, no tipper, probably not worth it there. Grunk takes his time and uses up his invincibility. Oh, fair just oh. too slow. And try to go for up air there. Yeah, probably could have finished players off the uh, <laughs> that. Pretty your favorite the next series. Down throw gonna kill. Do it. Yeah. Out the corner. Very close set between these two. Great Handshake set. Really close. Cinema. Nice stuff. Shot to Grunk. Doing the clutching. Uh, you can. 